So, welcome back to our EBC Brakes Tech Talk series. I'm down here in Bristol today at our friction factory and I'm here with Steve Payne, our Research and Development Manager. So, we're going to be looking at our motorcycle, scooter, ATV, UTV, or if you're watching in the States, side-by-side -side brake pads. So, let's get into this. So, today we're going to be talking about our semi-sintered motorcycle brake pads. Um, Steve, could I have a brief overview on what these pads are? Yep, here it is. This is the, uh, the semi sensor pad, so it's a heavy duty organic pad for street use. Okay, and what are these pads designed for? Uh, they're aimed at the, the big heavy cruisers, basically. Okay, and will I get an improved lever feel with these? Yeah, you should do with uh, organic pads in general. The uh, lever feel is very good, you get good, good modulation on the lever, uh, so yeah, you will. Okay, and are these road legal or Reg 90 approved? Yeah, they're road legal um, across the range. So legal for use anywhere. So if I was to buy these pads and I wanted to install them on my bike, do I have to buy new rotors with these or can I run them with any? No, you can run them with any. Um, I mean, EBC obviously have a, a very good range of rotors, yeah. but they will they will work against uh, any rotor. So with these, is it a necessity to upgrade to braided lines and upgrade my fluid or do I not really need to with these? No, you don't need to. I mean, it's, it can only help, but you can, uh, you can do a straight swap, put these in, leave everything else as is. So without going too much into detail, what goes into making an organic or a semi-sintered pad? Well, it's, it's organic because it's bonded uh, with uh, resin. So okay. it's, it's, a, it's a resin bonded pad, hence the, uh, the organic name. Uh, the semi-sintered comes from the fact that it's, it's got a very heavy copper loading. So it kind of sits somewhere between a traditional organic pad and a, and a full sintered pad. Okay, and can I use these on track? No, it's not a track pad. We've got other, other pads in the range that will do that job. This is a road pad. Okay, and what is the best way to bed these in? Uh, with most pads, you say try and take it easy, no emergency stops, no, nothing too quick for the yes. first couple of hundred miles, but uh, uh, full details are on the, on the site for the bedding for all the materials. Okay, well, thank you very much, Steve. And if you want to find out a bit more about these pads, head to the link in the description and keep an eye out on the channel for the next episode of this series. Thank you.